Hey guys and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be checking out the Welsh ponies. I'm super excited. I feel like I was very underprepared for this update. If you're wondering, I am wearing my Valentine's outfit. I was playing on Valentine's Day and I was like, okay, even though SSO isn't doing Valentine's Day this year, I'm going to still get in the Valentine's spirit. And so I dress like this. You're welcome. I am pretty sad there was no Valentine's event this year. Uh, I was mad. <laughs> Like, I was like, I love the Valentine's update. I'm assuming that these ponies are gonna be at um, Hermit's, Hermit's, oh, this is so annoying. Hermit's Cottage. Okay, let's go to Hermit's Cottage. I did look at the um, spoilers in another video I did, and I could tell you guys right now, I like don't remember what they look like. <laughs> I couldn't even tell you. Okay, this is a very small space to have new horses. I'm a little nervous, but I think we'll be okay. There's like no one here. Interesting. I think that this, we're gonna have to do some scientific research really quick. Okay, before I judge these horses, I want to see what they're supposed to look like in real life. Because as soon as I saw the horse's face, I was like, its face looks weird, but its face is weird in real life. Okay, good to know. Yeah, they have a weird face shape. It's like normal body and then what the heck? What is this small head? Oh yeah, they have a weird face shape in real life, guys. Okay, so if anyone's like, what the heck? These are ugly. It kind of has an Arabian sort of head. Anyways, now we can look at it with fresh eyes. Um, Okay, this isn't its hottest angle. They're a slight improvement on the old Welsh ponies, but I didn't like the Welsh ponies to begin with. Okay, but I do love this color. I'm like totally a spaz right now. Okay, I'll give you guys a legit, like I'll look at them for real, okay? So let's look at the body style. It's honestly really nice. I feel like it's got like muscles and lines and it's pretty standard. I actually really like the mane as is and that's a first because usually the mane as is recently has been really choppy and gross. Could you not, thanks. So yeah, I really like this horse. It reminds me of the Jorvik, the warm blood. If you guys know what I'm talking about, I have a warm blood with this exact coat color, but I really like this one. And I like the markings on the legs. They're really nice. And the hooves have really great details. Okay, so this is the first coat. And then this one is interesting to me because it's kind of like, wow, the eyes. The eyes are like this beautiful, like hazel. I don't know, they're like golden. I like this one because it's, I don't know, it's a Palomino, I think, but it's really different Palomino. The only thing is, oh, it kind of looks evil. <laughs> like, okay, yeah, the graphics on this horse are pretty good, especially the face, but the bodies are just, I can't get over that. But I think that they're weird looking in real life, so maybe that's just how it's gonna be. But I like this coat color. I think it's nice. It's like a cool Palomino. It's like a cool tone instead of a warm tone, which is really interesting. Then we have the classic chestnut. Man, this angle on these horses, I wish that they had moved the camera down like a little bit lower lower because they're kind of short and looking on them from this angle is very unflattering. It's already so much better, like such an improvement. Yeah, it kind of looks like an Arabian face, but I've heard they're related to the Arabians and so, wow, the way that the like shading goes into the stockings is really, really nice. I think this is one of my favorite coats. Okay, so we have the black Welsh pony, which is plain black. I feel like, I don't know, it has cool, it's cool that it has like purple violet eyes, but other than that, this horse is to me a little bit boring. I'd like to see how they look with like different mane styles, but the coat's very glossy, which is nice. Moving on. I do not like this horse one bit. The shading's all messed up. Like the fur details is nice and maybe people really like this coat color, but I think that it's just a poorly done coat in my opinion. Like the idea was there, but the color and execution wasn't quite there. Like I don't know, this color brown doesn't match the rest of the coat. There's just too many browns going on, but hey like to each their own maybe someone really likes it and the face is just the way it like comes out like this i'm not in love but it is unique i will give them that okay are there any other ones okay the welsh ponies of yorvik la, 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 la. oh wait there's a white is it gonna be on the app please tell me it's not gonna be on the app i love it <laughs> one horse is in fort pinta and the rest are in south Hook. we may possibly be getting the one in fort pinta let's see let's see how it goes we'll just we'll just see and the chestnut is really cute it kind of reminds me of the coloring of the fin horse that i didn't ever get so so far, I feel like this horse is the most similar in my excitement about them to the Percherons. I just wasn't very excited about them and don't love them very much, but ew, this is so creepy. Okay, don't talk about my horse that way, jerk. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Okay, guys, I would love this horse, 
but why does it have green eyes? Like, let's try to get it with its eyes closed. There we go. Um, coincidentally, someone's butt is in my- oh, perfect. Anyways, this horse is really pretty. I'm just gonna show you guys this horse without the eyes because the eyes are freaking creepy. I honestly am not even kidding you guys right now. I would have bought this horse, but I can't with these lime green eyes. Like, it's scary. And the muzzle is really nice and detailed. I don't know, this is a very different kind of eye animation to the other horses in Star Sable. The eyes are very big and they're large. <laughs> like, I don't even know how to- it's just a little too much for me. But I really like this horse. Like, it would have been nice, but yeah, I can't do it with the eye color. So, basically how much I like the Welsh ponies right now- oh, look, someone's riding the Palomino. I can't explain to you guys. I really like it, but then I like the idea of this pony, but then- there's something about it that like still looks old model to me. I don't know what it is. Am I being too picky? I don't know. And you guys know me. If you watch my channel, you know that I'm very positive and I'm like, I'm not a hater. I love Star Stable stuff right now. This isn't my favorite horse. I'm going to be honest with you guys. Am I still going to be getting one? Yes, because we need a horse to review. Hello. Okay, why did I come to Nolmer's Highland? I think that I'm going to get the chestnut, but I want to look at the eyes just to make sure that they're acceptable. Oh, and the name is still says Welsh Pony Type B. Like the names aren't edited. Okay, yeah, I like this one. I like how the eyes are just I mean, even though the eyes are huge, the normal color of the eyes makes it more realistic, which is the kind of horse I'm interested in. Yeah, I think this is probably the best it's gonna get. I mean, I also like this one, and it's very possible if I get the chestnut and I like it enough. Wait, dang it. Should I get this one because it's more unique? No. You know what? I'm gonna go with my gut. I'll get this horse if later I'm like, oh, I really like the Welsh Pony, and maybe this one. But if I don't like the Welsh Pony, then I'm gonna just have the chestnut. Is that boring? Possibly, but do I care? No. And they're only 800 star coins, which is actually, I think, fair. All right, I like the eyes on this one, and I think we're gonna go with it. Um, I used to have a horse named Ron, an Arabian that I sold, and its name was Firebolt, and so what if we just replaced Ron? This is a horse I feel like you have to ride it to know if you like it or not. Did I just spend 800 star coins? Yeah, I did. Oh, look at all my pretty horses. We're gonna put it in Alfred's place. Speaking of Alfred, I literally watched the Batman Begins, the Dark Knight series, like, five times this week. I don't even want to talk about it. Okay, so it's definitely a pony. The body structure is very similar to the old model ponies. I'm just gonna steal my tack from this horse, honestly. Oh, and guess what? Guys, while you were gone, I bought the saddle pad. So I was talking about this in another video, and I wanted to get this saddle pad because I saw someone wearing it, and it was really cute. So here we are. What am I doing? Wow, okay, there's a lot of cool mane styles on this horse, and I like how they have these braids, but they have these on the paint horses too. But these ones are shorter, and I think they're really cute. That's really interesting. Yeah, I prefer the shorter ones. And then they have the braids, which I don't think is flattering on this horse's neck because they have a weird shaped neck. And then they have a buzz cut, a fin, and a long mane, which reminds me of the old model Pentabian, so I'm not into that. And then they have this interesting crop haircut, which is very interesting. I don't have any other words to say except it's interesting. The hair is like a hand. Like, it looks like the fingers are like coming out. I- what is wrong with me? I'm gonna keep the hair it has right now. The braids to do a little something for it, but also I kind of like this hair, so let's keep it for now. Sometimes when you get like a brand new horse, maybe it's just because I never feed my horses, but they I fed them today, okay. I think that sometimes when I get on new horses, I'm like, they're so fast, but it's just because they've been fed, but this horse doesn't feel very fast. I don't know what to say about that. All right, let's look at some things. So here we have the walk. I think the walk looks pretty normal. The front walk looks pretty stiff. It looks like it has arthritis, but that's kind of how the old ones look too. The trot is really nice, I will say. From the front, everything looks weird. Like the front of this horse is just a little, it's a little off. Like I just don't love it and I'm not gonna buy another one, I decided. Okay, then we have the canter, which actually looks pretty good to me. Nothing is disgusting to me. Okay, and then the slow gallop. The head looks kind of weird in the slow gallop and the bridle's eating my horse's neck, but, or the other way around. Can we have the fast gallop? I actually think that's really cute. I think the fast gallop's really cute. The way its head just does that is adorable to me. Okay, and then let's do a jump from Canter. Oh, that's nice. They're really good at the jumps. Yeah, that's a really cute jump. That's super cute. I would buy this horse if I just saw this picture right now. I'm kidding, by the way. That's a good rear. So it just like steps forward a little bit and then steps back. It's cute. Okay, and then we have the hard stop. 
Okay, it kind of looks like the quarter horse hard stop. Where is a place that we can take good Valentine's pictures? Wait, I kind of love this. Look at the camera. Okay, guys, this has been me buying the Walsh pony. I'm really interested to know, like, I haven't watched any videos, so I'm interested to know what everyone else thinks about the Welsh ponies. So let me know in the comments what you guys think, whether you like them, if it's not your favorite, if you hate it with a passion, let me know. And thanks for watching. Bye. I'm on the nice, you never guess I've been hiding a monster Keeping it quiet